What we have seen here is a real transformation from row housing that was in terrible condition into now a viable community. The old Strathmore Estates, the buildings were actually built in the 1940s and they were built for workers who worked on the Liberty ships. When they built it, it was termed in the newspaper articles as demountable housing. So they envisioned it going up for a very short period of time through the war, and then after the war, they envisioned it coming down. But it never came down. Once that was over, then it became a very profitable venture uh, to put low-income people in here uh, without keeping up with the housing codes and modernizing, and so it fell into terrible disrepair. The Savannah Gardens Project came as a result of our efforts to reduce slum housing in the city of Savannah. CHSA, what we are, we're actually a nonprofit organization that was founded by the city and the area local banks. And our mission, again, was here to provide affordable housing here in the city. We are actually the master developers of Savannah Gardens. Mayor Otis Johnson had this vision, you know, of putting in affordable housing and making it available for people to become first-time homeowners. Because if you go around the perimeter, you'll see a lot of single-family homes that we built for first-time home buyers. And it's not just apartments, but it's actually changing residents' lives, putting them to a point where they can become homeowners. Mr. Dyer asked us to work with him in Scrap Mode to get these started. We went to a lot of meetings and we designed just about everything you see. We actually got input from all the other surrounding areas, uh, neighborhoods, and the residents that actually live here. We actually used their input and they could actually see what they said, you know, they wanted to stay or wanted to be developed. So it was, it was great. I've been working with Mr. Days for the last eight years, you know, hand in hand, and, and, and he's, he's a great guy. He takes care of the community. This development came up because we were a team. We worked together. We made decisions. Savannah Gardens is, is now the kind of community that we want in all sections of our city. It has changed the area completely. Crime stat has dropped like 60% to what it was when it was Strathmore Stays. Through the work of the city and other nonprofits, it has been transformed into something that everyone in Savannah is very proud of now. You know, you always want that, that project that would just be the project. This was the project for, for CHSA. So, I mean, it was a great project and still is a great project. If you look on the east side, we still have all that open land. So hopefully we can do some more units there and we can build some more single family homes over there just to build it out completely and that would be to me, the final phase of Savannah Gardens. So uh, it's been a fun project. It has been, and it's really rewarding. Uh, just fun. <laughs>